Okay, guys, so as you are writing your story for a book, which I'm doing, um, read while you do this. It will help you. Read a lot. So um, I incorporated today about not even knowing the signs of pregnancy. I had no idea. I had called a pregnancy center today, and they had on their website um, know the signs know the signs you're pregnant. And I would not have known this until I was an adult. There was no way I would have known, you know, did I have bloating? Did I have back aches? Did I have breast tenderness? Did I, um, you know, have um, any of the other symptoms, right? I wouldn't have known this until later on for me when I was pregnant. And like when I had my, what was it? My fourth son, it was just knowing the tenderness right there. That that I was pregnant. So, um, also research, which I, I have a book, um, I'm ordering about how the 16 year old brain does work. Um, get in there, dig in when you're doing your story. I listened to Brooke Shields today, talk about how her mother used her as a pawn. Um, back in the day, that's how society was. And for someone to think a girl cannot have a forced abortion unless she's sex trafficked, is absurd. There are a million dynamics that go into relationships, right? We look at facial expressions, tone of voice, um, you know, the background that you were brought up in, the friends, the um, what you learned, how did you process things. There are a million things that affect abortion. So it's not something that we can easily judge. Um, it's, it's really important to try to understand the bigger picture of this too. And then what my mother went through, my mother um, grew up with paddy wagons, right? So uh, that name I looked up and it was meant for Irishmen who many Irishmen were the police back in the day. Um, but a lot of um, people were taken you know, to jail through the paddy wagons. So I did not have all of her experience in the background of her thoughts on everything. And then you have my father's thoughts and how he was brought up on a farm and what exactly did he know about babies, right? In that generation, men didn't even enter, you know, the hospital room. You were not even allowed in. So there are so many facets to this Continue adding blanks to your story and try to write in what you do know.